Happy Independence Day, Luna. Not a bad spot. Hello everyone, and welcome back to Uncomplication. Ryan and Luna here, as always. And um, it's 4th of July in the United States. It's Independence Day. And I'm out here uh, feeling independent. Uh, I went on a little hike and I found this rock. And now I'm just kind of climbing around on it. Feeling my body move. Uh, feeling my weight in my hands and my legs. And my dog coughing and barfing. And I am out here sort of meditating on independence because this is Independence Day in the United States. And this is a day when um, our country uh, became a country and broke from the power systems in Europe that were um, taking unfairly from a people that uh, felt that they had other interests other things that they wanted to contribute to the world and it was a it was a revolutionary war that um, took us from one system to another and gave us a government of the people for the people and by the people uh, and now that was uh, over two centuries ago and today I'm out here climbing around in a world that is really um, driven by corporations and driven by large interests that don't necessarily have my best interest at heart. Um, there's a lot of people that would make a ton of money if I were to get cancer or if I were to uh, lose my home or, uh, or if I were to watch a Liberty Mutual ad and decide that I really need to customize my insurance and that becomes my priority. So there is happening right now a revolutionary war, but it's not a people fighting uh, for the interests of the people. It is a war for our minds. And I know that what brought a lot of you to this channel in the first place was a, a form of independence, was this, um, this space of crypto that for the average person held a lot of promise and potential that we could escape the system that has been preying on us and that we could take matters back into our own hands. And I know when I started putting my money from fiat dollars into uh, Bitcoin and Ethereum and Cardano and these uh, different projects that uh, have this vision of a of a decentralized um, empowered future that I really drank from that uh, fire hose and reveled in that narrative only to come to the realization that um, these markets and these technologies are woven into this exact same system and that um, you cannot from within the system, escape the system. So what does that all mean? Why am I up here blabbing at you? Um, I feel that there is an opportunity to see things from some different perspectives. Even though I am set in this matrix and I have all of these responsibilities and all of these traps that have me stuck in a lot of ways, that within that I have a huge amount of power in my own health and well-being and in my mind. And indeed there is a battle for our minds happening and there is this uh, stream of ideas and content and perspective that is trying to flavor our, our view of the world in some very specific ways but we have the power and we have the, the independence to um, change those streams, to turn off the news, to um, seek connections at a community level or a family level or even a personal level or to engage in conversation one-to-one um, -one as people 
not just talking and chattering about this kind of um, superficial uh, big picture, but really rooting into that experience of the here and now. And I'm here, I'm in the sunshine, I'm talking into this camera. It's actually a very strange experience for me, but in this moment, in this presence, I am alive. And I have, I have every opportunity, in fact, this is my only opportunity to, to live and to be grateful and to appreciate what it means to be in existence. And that's where I wanna find independence and that's where I invite you to look for your independence. Not necessarily independence from a financial system, independence from a network of trucks and trains that feed you, but independence in that you have the ability to think any thought, to go anywhere with your intention, and to put that into the world in a positive way that affects people. So that even if you die this afternoon, this, this happening is a reflection of you as well. And we don't have to change the whole thing to have our life be meaningful. And so I can tell you, you listening to this right now as you are, are so important in that this entire reality is being created through you and by you. And that you are um, an agent of change and an agent of life and experience and if you can anchor into that and you can find that in the moment, um, that independence can unfold in incredible ways. So I know this is a little bit different than uh, what I've been posting in the past, but these are just the thoughts that are rattling through my head today. Uh, I will be back with more um, kind of on topic uh, content, but um, happy Independence Day. Um, see what that means to you. Uh, whether or not you're a United States citizen, uh, find some independence, find some independent thought, and um, yeah, let me know uh, in the comments what you, um, where you pointed that attention. So uh, until next time, cheers.